Another beautiful day in Paris in the Vanty of Oh, I just tripped. Let's try that again. Anyways, what's up, guys? It's another beautiful day in Paris. I'm running really, really late right now. So I'm like speed walking to the metro station. I just shoved an entire bowl of French cereal down my throat, rushed out of there, and hopefully I won't be too late to class. I do have a test today and tomorrow, so I really need to be there. Also, do you hear that? No honking, no screaming, no singing. This is honestly like the first quiet day since, since the World Cup. Even most of the trash has been picked up. Nobody compares to you. Nobody compares to you. I'm upset. 50. Which one should I get? The really, the really, the really big one is 130. The really big one. Don't get that. That job one is nasty. Get this Wait, one. This is six euros? Yeah, so buy the one Wait. euro one. This is a oh, okay. It's about three times the size Why of this. Why should I get this? No. Gee, look at it. Sub it, sub it. Put the bread away. You know it's dry when it's Put the bread. Feel this bread. Up. This thing feels like really a brick. Tired. You could meta someone with this. It's good. This is so boring. <laughs> like oh my my God. God. This is like a bad thing. That's the bad thing. I, I actually think all of Front Prix right is gonna burn Sylvan. Every Front Prix in France is gonna burn Sylvan. I'm pretty tired. <laughs> and we had an exam today that I studied a lot for. And we have another one tomorrow. I'm a little tired if I haven't said but that. But hey, we're going to. We're but we're going to eat some bread and go to the Rodin. Mm -hmm. We're going to the Musée Rodin. Mm -hmm. We're going to see Thanker. Le Ponceur. Le Ponceur, oui. oui. I did my like, opt for the baguette. After taking, who knows, like 12 minutes to decide which type of bread she should get. Uh, okay. We finally because, got out of the well, store. This one, this particular one is not that good. I think the other bread would have been better. You know, so also don't like, always succumb to peer pressure. Like, you should cross it. You'll be better off. There it is. Where is it? There. Where's the tower? Oh, right there it there. is. <laughs> right there. Sponsor me Diet Coke. This is what I'm talking about. What? Look at that. Oh yeah. It looks like I give birth to the Eiffel Tower. That's what, yeah. <laughs> That's exactly what we're looking for, I bet. Right there. That's where the bag was stolen. That's where it was all stolen. Oh. Right on that bench. It wasn't the bench's fault, nope. but still salty. <sighs> I'm just saying, I've gotten so much like more used to just like talking to the camera in public and having people look at me weirdly. Yeah, you know? I mean, for someone who posts so many YouTube videos, you should have gotten to you used to that by now. Especially in Paris, like where like speaking English distinguishes you as like immediately American and people stare at you anyways. I think people can tell even if we don't speak Josh. Yeah. <laughs> Especially when I'm walking around with like my phone held up to my face. But uh, yeah, just got out of a French magic shop. It was pretty cool. Didn't see David Stone there. A little disappointed, but you know, it's not like tannins. Nothing can be tannins. But it was pretty cool. Um, there were some people doing some stuff. They had a large collection of like old, old magic props. A lot of cool cards. Something I wanted to check out before I headed out. But now we're on our way to uh, Le Pont Mirabeau. Le Pont Mirabeau. Exactly. Which was a poem we had to memorize during. Can you, can you try year. reciting the poem? Sur le pont Mirabeau, coule Seine. Et nos amours, faut-il qu'il m'en souvienne? We are now sur le pont Mirabeau. We are sur? Sur le pont Mirabeau. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get sur le pont. We're not, we're not sur le pont Mirabeau. <laughs> we're almost there though. 
Yeah, it's, it's pretty nice from up here. The Eiffel Tower. And we got the OG Statue of Liberty right there. Yep. Sous le pont Mirabeau, pour le Seine. Et nous avons une photo de Pino, mon souvenir. Après le pain. Have you seen Guillaume's signature? Vienne la nuit, sonne le. Les jours sont vent. Je te vois. I've been moving kind of sun, no trouble with me. Trying to keep it peaceful is a struggle for me. Don't pull up at 6 a.m. and cuddle with me. You know how I like it when you love it on me. I don't want to dive in and miss me. Guess I see the things that they wishing on me. Hope I got some brothers that I live me. Oh, before I forget, I have to introduce you to my favorite French fast food place of all time. And it is right there. You can't see the sign, but it is a place called Otacos that my French host brother actually introduced me to. Basically, they, you pick your meat, and then they take, people are looking at me because I'm speaking English in the middle of a French street corner and holding a phone up to my face. But uh, you put whatever meat you want, and then you, they add fries and cheese and put it in a tortilla. It's absolutely amazing. <laughs> We are at uh, Notre Dame. I've actually, I was here in two other videos that I filmed previously. Um, we actually came here like the very first day after class. Uh, we walked to the, the Pantheon and then to Notre Dame. And we're also here the night of the 4th of July, which was pretty cool, except for at night, the bushes around here uh, are just absolutely filled with rats. So it's, it's quite strange, actually. Uh, I think I have video, or my friends might have video. I'll throw it in if, if I have it. I keep saying that I'm going to go to Mass here, but I haven't made it yet, so, uh, Mom, if you're watching this, I'm gonna try, okay? Speaking of rats... Down what I've been chasing, 